Vina del Mar portion of the trip. And now we are going camping in Siete Taza. So stay tuned for the next video. <laughs> like and subscribe. All right, five hours of driving later, one hour of which was on dirt roads. We made it to the campground at 9.15, it's like 9.20 now or something, and the campground, or the front desk is supposed to close at 10, there's a sign that says it closes at 10 and no one's there. So the plan is we pick our own camping spot, even though we're supposed to have a camping spot that they're telling us, but they're not here to tell us. We're picking our own camping spot and we'll just like talk to them in the morning, I guess. So we brought a bunch of vegetables to cook, but that was assuming we had a fire and also a knife. So I don't really know how we're gonna cut them tomorrow, but this is the camping stove and this is the pan. I just cut the mushrooms because it turns out this is the only knife uh, we brought. So moss is over there, putting the tent up in the dark and I'm cooking mushrooms and sausage over this little tiny stove in this little tiny pan. No plates, so we're using foil. No forks, so we're using our fingers. No fire because there was nobody at the information booth. Here we have sausages and here's our dinner. Is it good? Excellent, thank you. We have some bread and so we made sausage sandwiches and now we are happy. Except okay. for we need bug, bug spray. Okay, so now Tomas was gonna open the second bottle of wine. And then, <laughs> wait, wait, wait. He, I broke the, the cork. He broke the corkscrew in the cork. It's it's in there. It's metal in there now. And okay. so now you have so to this. dig it out. See, it's broken. <laughs> it's in there. New discovery. Uh, he did not bring pillows, only towels and sleeping bags. So good thing I have my little neck pillow from the plane. Good morning. Hello. No cereal. Balls. So. For lunch we have baguette with jamon serrano and blue cheese and that is what you eat when you are with a French Chilean. Yay! <laughs> blue cheese and jamon serrano make me very happy. Tomas carried all the wood. Yay, we finally bought firewood. can. I thought it was empty. I swam over there to pick trash out because I hate when people leave trash in nice places. And it turns out it's not sealed. So now I'm going to drink it. Tomas swam all the way out to that waterfall 
and went behind it and he came back and he said it was really cool so I swam out there and I got next to it but I didn't get under it because I was so cold and I was shaking and I just couldn't do it um, but overall I forget what that place is called Sal Salto and uh, Leona or something like that uh, anyway we're back at the camp there's a lot of bugs out here and <laughs> we're gonna make a fire and hobo stew well first we showered but now we're doing that how was the shower? It was terrible. It was completely cold. Even more cold than at the swimming pool. At the pool that we were. It was so cold. But you washed your hair? Oh well, I didn't wash my hair. Okay, so for our hobo stew, we have the steak, some steak, and then uh, some beets, carrots, whoops, mushrooms, um, bell pepper, cilantro, onion, and then we have um, some spices that it's just meat spices. So it looks like this when you put it all together. Put it in the fire for half an hour. All this focus coming on me. And the hobo stew is done. Yum. Good morning. It's our last day at Siete Tazas camp. And we are, I think we're just going to maybe walk around the camp for a little bit. Pack up and go to Santiago. This is from the rocks of, at the waterfall at Salta de la Leona yesterday.